Oh, well ain't this fun? No, not really. It's a rubbish party with the only ones under 80. Behave, and I wouldn't say that too loudly. They are likely to lynch you, and more importantly, me, by association. I can see it now. Death by Zimmer frame. God, I am bored. And I am missing Cory. I hope Sky Plus recorded. Norris is having the boil on his bum last. Oh, is that tonight? And we are missing it. I can't bear it. Missing that landmark televisual moment and all just for the sake of your grand's birthday party. I know no considerations and people she could have been born on a Sunday. Erm um, right. So Tiger, how old is she today? No idea. I've never dared ask her. She clipped me round the ears last time I asked her to pass the brown sauce. I don't blame her. The trouble she went to with that turkey. She needn't have bothered. It was dry and chewy. To be fair to her, I think that was more our fault. Come again. Damn tiger. Not with all these old folks watching. There's some nice gardens out there though. Behave. Or you're blushing. Or that's so cute it makes me feel all warm inside. That's cause you are a right trendy tart. Busted and you are as bad? That's why the turkey was so dry and chewy. I mean we could have just replaced the bulb in the fairy lights, rather than spend half an hour jiggery pokering in the dark in the bogey hole, supposedly looking for the fuse box. True but that wouldn't have been so much fun. I can't think of anything that gets even close. Exactly. And especially not the sound of music, what out to bollocks. Life's not all cute dancing kids and singing nuns. I know it's more spoilt whiny brats and flying fists. You know the old dear with the ferret in her handbag. Yes. She scares me. I think that's the idea. It's working. She's still holding a grudge against us for missing that. Her and her ferret growl at me every time I pass. I don't get the big fuss about missing it anyway. They've watched it every year since before I was born. I don't think it is that old of a film. Humph. Sorry, Tiger. For teasing you. It'll be a Christmas tradition for them. What like my Uncle Derek setting his moustache on fire with the JD and rum plum pudding? Your Uncle Derek hasn't got a moustache. Exactly. Oh shit went. I had to put it out with the squirty cream. Oh brother. Oh no he's not escaped again. Why don't they make those places more secure? Escaped. What? He was just working over Christmas in one of those holly day inns. Yes, you know he is a real rebel without a clause. Oh, you? You really slay me. And it would be rude of me not to say I love you, Randy Tart. Oh, Tiger, I love you too. You Santa, mental old fool you. Bed bath. Okay, but just for starters, just so long as sausage is on the menu. Oh, yes. Get in. Come on, we are wasting time. They'll never miss us. 